Bowling Green. Neatly there, Cheryl. We've made it to Bowling Green at least. Or at last, I don't, I, I didn't pay attention. Nix, wait, what the hell are you doing, Nix? By a Nat's whisker. I think I'd better stash my basket somewhere so the police will find it. Good idea. Not like we can go back to the river Chester Lane. We'll have to lay low for here for a while. Oh! What? Is it the pigs? No, look! That sounds over there, isn't it? Hans? Ah, you nearly gave me a heart attack. Detective! So stupid police still haven't caught you. Good. Yes, we made it to around, around them so far, Hans. It's all part of thanks to you and your brother. But what are you doing here? Working. I fixed statue. Really? I didn't know you did that kind of work as well. I do all work. We do not drink only tea like you, British. And you should not be wasting time here. Go into back streets where it is harder to find you. Yes, that's my plan. I wish you luck that super police don't find you. Thanks, Hans. Bye. So now we need to head back to the dark and dingy back streets of Bowling Hill. Exactly. Come along. Oh boy. Nice. Oh. Puzzle. Why? Look at there's a puzzle in the street lamp. Oh, well spotted show. Let me see if I can solve it quickly. Ghosts and Gifts 3. I don't remember, did I do... Because I remember doing this one for uh, this one, so I, but I don't remember if it was a 2 or 1. <coughs> a little girl's desperate to win a stuffed toy at the fairground. So she's trying her hand at the game of all Ghosts and Gifts. You have to line up all the gifts horizontally, vertical, or diagonally to win. But if you the line of ghosts while you're shifting things around, you lose. You can move the ghost and the gift step down left, right, into an empty space. Okay. And I probably need to do it all in 12 moves. Okay. <coughs> I was so close, but no, I can already tell it's not gonna work. Because I wanted to read them diagonally. Okay. Okay, so. <coughs> Give me a moment, okay guys? Let's see if I can do this again. But I think the diagonal one here is the best choice. Uh, BRB when I have this, when I have it all complete, okay? A few inches later. There, perfect. I've seen how to solve this now. And that's how it's done. You did it, yeah. There are puzzles everywhere, aren't there? If you keep your eyes peeled, you never, you need never be bored, bored calling again. Exactly. So let's see how many more you can find. If nothing else, it makes my mind of other, of other, of other things. I still believe there is one in the lights. Okay, I already found this one, I think, and uh... oh, nice. I think I'm gonna find Laura Guard a little now, sure. Oh well, yeah, there's no way the police will spot us here. Are you barking? We're still right in the open. Mm, I suppose you're right. This probably is a little too exposed still. Let's hunt da down the same smaller street to uh, somewhere less obvious. You mean the ally where you can't, uh, you know, escape if you get cornered? Wouldn't it have been better for you to, I don't know, go for the shop right here where you can, you know, disguise yourself by getting some costumes? And yeah, then again, I wouldn't be surprised if... Oh, nice. Then again, I wouldn't be surprised if Perfetti was already aware of that. If you that. 
Yeah, I remember her name was Emiliana, but I just wanted to feel more comfortable for her perfecting. I'm not sure why. Wait, I just heard one a dink pad. Aha! There you go. Let's go. There could be a puzzle there, but who knows? Alright, now we can pause for breath. We should be safe here. Well, safe fish. Yes, let's just have a little rest. Uh oh, there's someone there. What? Where? Oh, yes, over there. It's. Ratsman! Which you already know who it is. Which I guess makes sense. He does tend to be here a lot. Why? <coughs> I can't tell if the junk is, is junk or something someone else is used, still using. Well, it looks like it's operational, so I'd say it's probably still in use. And it's having a puzzle too, if I'm not mistaken. Stop the bomb. The timer on the bomb is taken away. Apparently, can be stopped if you connect the numbers one to six in order. If you select the number panel, it changes color. Find a sequence number somewhere in the middle of the bomb. Okay. Okay, so I can go like this. Okay, okay, okay. As I'm gonna say, there's one, two, three, four, five, and six here. Okay, but we can go diagonally. Okay, that does make it even more interesting. Eventually. Okay, after much deliberation, I think I figured it out. It's, I think it's here. One, two, three, four, five, six. There. This puzzle's got some bite. I ain't happy about the helm, dog. You did it, time has stopped. What a relief. Thank God this puzzle was an accurate time. If not, I'd be screwed. It's like quite impressive that someone's trying to keep this whole thing going. That's true. It's important to let things be thrown away just because they're old and look a bit sorry for themselves. I mean, you're not wrong, but there are times when it's just best to get something new. Mind you, I'm horrible at that because I, I hate throwing stuff away. Yeah, I think that... Oh, wait. Let's talk to Raffin now. Like a rodent from the gutter, he appears. Crooks and villains tremble in fear. The Parmas of Justice is here. Da -da -da. Yeah, I'm not saying that all that. Ratman! I know that voice. Is that you, Mr. Chance? Mr. Chance? Perhaps at first glance. But no. Join the lens. I'm Ratman! Sorry, yes, of course. But I'm glad it's you, though, Mr. Ch Ratman. Not the police. I'm out for a stroll on patrol. Looking for a troubled soul, I'd rather I found one, judging by the fa by the face of one. Well, the thing is, the police are after me because they think I murdered Clover Price, the owner of the Lucky Clover on Chester Lane. I didn't do it, of course, obviously. That's the pits, those rotten crits, accusing you of a crime you didn't didn't commit. Uh huh. Aha. Well, let your but don't let your spirits fall. I'm well aware of all your deeds you've done, and so are the good people of London. Everyone does. Katya Layton's nose is as clean as a ghost. So stand tall, rise above all. Rise above it all. Yeah, he's having a bit of trouble with all the rhyming, I kinda like it. Thank you, Ratman. You've given my first strength to carry on. Good to hear. Have no, have no fear. Sooner or later, you'll be in the clear. Yes, I'm innocent and believe the truth will prevail in the end. Although, beyond the run like this, I'm not exactly sure how that's going to happen. How long am I going to have to remain a fugitive? Who's going to prove that I'm innocent? Talking to yourself, to yourself again, Cat? Yes, yes I am. I can't believe I've been so blind. There is no one else who's going to prove my innocence. No one else except me. Aha! A bulb lights in your hair and snogging. The answer to the riddle comes a knocking. Yes, Miss Layton, it falls to you. But no one's better at getting out of us too. 
Guesses will be served in due course. Uh -huh. Thank you, Rackman. So how are we going to do it then, Cat? How are we going to clear your name? By investigating the case and determining who the real culprit was, of course. So I must go straight back to Chancellor Lane. Brilliant idea. Hornets' nests are such fun things to walk into. If I don't investigate the scene of the crime, I'll never be able to prove that I didn't do it. We have to get inside the Lucky Clover. I know it's dangerous, but it's a risk we're going to have to take. <sighs> Alright. I don't want to rain on your parade. It was a light bulb moment, after all. Thank you, Sherlyn. Sorry I've been dragged into this. I can't even make exceptions to the enemy's resolve model just because the mystery relates to a member of the pack. Otherwise, there is no hope of you making any progress in the conversational Canada case, is there? And anyway, I don't like that Britannias. I just want to bite him. How dare he accuse you of being a murderer? He's really taking the biscuit. So I say, let's find the real killer and show what I so and so up for being so sure of himself and so wrong. Yes, I'm so in agreement with you. Alright then, Chancellor here we come. No! Okay, so there was a mosquito on my screen. Ah, no. Uh, oh, no. And I squished it, but it had blood. It had my blood. Well, I saw my blood. Hold on, guys. I need to, I'll be... BRB, I need to, you know, clean this here. Uh, hold on. While Patchy pulls himself together, let's see how SpongeBob's party is shaping up. Okay, I'm back now. Thankfully, I was able to clean it. But I had to get a cloth wet to do it. I think I can read. Oh, it's like a proof of innocence. I didn't read the title of the whole thing. Again, I'm not sure how that would count as a clue, but okay, whatever. Luckily, it was in the police then. No, so back to your home territory, yes? I need to get on my bike, Cheryl. What the hell? Get away from the giant ball. It will take a particular road starting at the top left and going down the bottom to the bottom right. If you're hit by the ball or have nowhere left to go, you lose. The ball and the bike move at the same time. In each turn they move on one square. The bike can travel through any square that has been through before. Okay, I'm a bit confused, but I, I think I need to. Oh, okay, okay, I, I think I get it. I need to make it so that once I get to the top, like for example, the ball is already there where it stops. Okay. So here, 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 and here, I believe. Yeah, okay. Mm, this should do it, I think. I also failed to mention that that little anime to be that happened for no good reason other than it just to be comical, I think, is was well, is also part of the intro that I showed you guys without some way in the beginning. Yeah, close enough. Put the doggy in the basket! <laughs> Oh, 
That was too close for comfort. Hey, look, we're back here right, right where we started. What the actual hell? Also, what was the point of that? Uh, uh, it was a little more exciting uh, than I had bargained for. We were very nearly flattened. Sure, the police could have been behind that, could they? Hard to believe they used such a rough tactics. But who else would have done it? It was a bit over the top for the police, though. Maybe they're just so desperate to catch you, they've lost all sense of what's right and wrong. Maybe. Anyway, we better be on the lookout for other dangers. Alright, come on then, let's hurry back to the Lucky Clover now. Wait, but didn't it say before that... Didn't Han say before that... That the... No. Okay. Didn't Han say before that the, the statue apparently was broken and he came there to fix it? Oh wait, the bike's already here, what am I doing? Oh, I can even choose, that's like interesting. Ah! There. My left bumper, the L1, is actually bad. 